I'm going to do some random pulls for Japanese Mahjong, also known as Richi. If you're new to this version, there are links in the video description below to a wonderful tutorial by Hana Yuri Uta. It's a bit long, but it's worth the watch. There's also a primer by Dina Chiba and a book by Scott Miller. I recommend all three of those for learning the fundamentals and even a little strategy. Don't forget to download this player reference so that you can learn the Yaku and how to score. We're going to do six random pulls to practice identifying a Yaku in a dealt hand. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. We're going to alternate between east and south round. We'll roll these dice to determine which player we are. So for the first random pull, we'll be in west seat. West seat, east round, two bams Dora. All number tiles but one, single north. Pair of ones. Pair of threes. We have a chi here. Potential chi, potential chi, isolated. One, two, three, four. Okay, I would play pinfu here. What would be really nice is to maybe use this for a two, three, four, or a one, two, three, so we could use Dora. So here, I would try for Pinfu and Ricci. I would discard the North and then pick by pick, improve the weights and discard isolated tiles. So like these right now are isolated. Here we have a closed weight where we need the tile in the middle. So that's a bit weak. Here's a side weight where we need a tile on either side. Tiles four, five, and six are the most useful. And here we have edge chi tiles, one, two, three, or seven, eight, nine. So I think I would definitely discard the north first and just decide pick by pick, but try for Pinfu and Ricci, stay concealed. We do have four, five, three, five, and a three. So maybe discard the north or the seven next. And then if we get a four dot or a five dot, we could play mixed triple chi here. It's light with dots though. Three, four, five in each suit. The potential's there. If you would do something differently here, write pull one in the comment section below and what you would try for here. South round. This time we're going to be in west seat. I might have messed that up last time. I don't remember. It didn't matter because we didn't have the right winds. So south round, west seat, 13 tiles. Red, white, and green is the progression. White dragon is Dora right here. We have five, six, four, five, six, pair of ones. 
I think I would try for mixed triple chi Sanshoku hold Dora to see if we could maybe pair up and pwn for our other block and use this as a pair. So I think I would probably discard the one crack first. Try to draw in a five bam or a six bam. Discard the two then the nine. We're in west seat, so this north won't be any good for us. Since this is Dora, maybe we should discard these first. Since they could be, well, the green dragon would be a valued honor. This could be a valued honor for north. Maybe discard here first and keep the number tiles. Either way, we have one, two, three blocks, four with, the, with our pair. And then if we try to use Dora, for either a pair or a pawn. If we use Dora for a pair, we could maybe pawn here for our fourth block. One, two, three, four, five. The problem is this is one single tile. We would need to draw a five bam or a six bam to make mixed triple chi work. So that was pull two. If you would have done something differently here, let me know in the comment section below. East round. We're going to be east this time. One dot is Dora, right there. So we have Dora. Single honors, pair of nines, pair of twos. Potential chi, potential chi with Dora. Pair, potential chi, potential pwn. Or we could break that up and do a potential chi. I think what I would do here is discard the single honors, hold number tiles and play pinfu, and make sure one of my cheese has Dora. If we draw ones, we could maybe play Chanta though. So maybe instead discard the six and see about playing Chanta, because we could chi, chi, potentially chi, if we get a one crack and a three crack, chi or pwn, pair up and pwn. We're in east seed, it's east round. None of these are gonna bring us any value. Maybe pinfu because of that would be better. If any of these were paired up, I think I would play chanta, but since they're not, maybe pinfu would be better. One, two, three, four. We need more chi tiles. But we're closer to Pinfu than I think we are Chanta. We would have two discards for Chanta. And one, two, three blocks. If we played Pinfu, we have one, two, three, four, or four. I think we have one more block for Pinfu than we do Chanta. So I think what I would do here is discard one of these first. See what comes in. If we pair up a wind, maybe go with Chanta and discard the two. See if we can get a one, two, three, and then discard the six. But 
If instead we draw number tiles, including simples, get rid of these and play Pinfu and Ricci, stay concealed. Let me know what you think about pull three. South round, pull four. This time we're going to be east again. We have a wind for the indicator. Eat soup with nuts. North is Dora. Right there. We're in east seat and it is south round. We have a north, single north. Here's a pawn of dragons. No other multiples. Potential chi. Here's a chi right here. Potential chi, potential chi. One, two, three, four, five. Side weight, closed weight, closed weight. I think maybe what I would do here is play Yakuhai, try to stay concealed in Richi. If not, Chi and play Yakuhai alone. Maybe even wait for this for a pair. If we draw it, that would be ideal because then we could leverage Dora. But as a single, it's not going to help. And we have one, two, three, four, five blocks without it. So I think, I think what I would do here is discard the three dot first. See if we could complete these cheese concealed or maybe draw north for Dora. and play Yakuhai and Ricci. If the drawing doesn't go well, claim discards to complete and play Yakuhai alone. Fifth one, east round. We're gonna be in south seat. Eight Bamas Dora, right there. I think I would try for a pure straight. Pure straight is called Itsu. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have a potential Chi. Eight Bamas Dora, East round we're in south seat this would not bring us any value i think i would discard that see if we could do it concealed in ricci if not chi throughout and pair up here discard north first focus on pure straight maybe pinfu and ricci we have a side weight right here you have to have a side weight for re, for pinfu and a valueless pair. So we would have a little work to do for this if it's going to be Ricci and Pinfu concealed with a pure straight. Let me know what you think about that. This is pull five. South. Last one. This time, we're going to be in North Seat.
6 p.m. is Dora. No Dora here. So we have mixed suits, one single honor, potential chi, potential chi, pair, potential chi, pair, potential chi, or potential chi here. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see, potential chi there. Let's see here. You know what? If we discard this one bam and the west, we could do all simples and pwn. So potential pwn here and here. Potential chi, potential chi, potential chi. So potential pwn or pair and play all simples, tan yao. If we could do it concealed, even better. Tan Yao and Ricci. If we get the right tiles, one, two, three, four, five. All simples and Pinfu and Ricci. One, two, three, four. Well, we do have a potential Chi here with a one. But if we get rid of that and build up here instead, like maybe do three, four, pair, six, seven, four, five, use this as the pair, one, two, three, four, we're short. We need, we, we have work to do. If we play Tanyao though, we have all the blocks we need. One, two, three, four, five. Pwn or pair chi these for Tanyao. If we did it concealed, we could Ricci. Tanyao and Ricci. I think I would try for Tanyao and Ricci. Discard the West and the One and hold simples. Let me know what you think about that sixth pull. If you're just learning Ricci and you're studying the Yaku, you have a set of tiles at home, get it out and do random pulls. Make sure you download this player reference so that you can have it out while you do the exercises. Try to identify the strength in your dealt hand, but also see if you can identify a potential Yaku because you have to have a Yaku to even qualify to win. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next set of random pulls for Japanese Mahjong, also known as Ricci, may all your picks be keepers.